everybody, Tools in Action today! Tool fights. I know we've had Friday night tool fights and you know they staggered, we didn't do them for a while. They're coming back in a huge way. This is by, we've just been trying to figure out what to do. I know you guys are throwing them at us. We gotta come up with a way that we can actually just keep all this stuff in one area. We got YouTube comments, we got site comments, we got Facebook comments, we got Twitters. We got the forum. The forum. We just got massive information coming in from everywhere so it's hard to keep up with all this but we're going to figure it out someday and maybe get this thing uh, under, control. under control. But for today, we're going over uh, two major drill brands. And we know you guys have been uh, kind of wanting us to compare these. But we sat down and really we can't compare unit to unit. So what we've done is we've come up and uh, what we're going to do is we're going to put the DCD985 brushed drill with a 4, hour, four amp hour battery against uh, Milwaukee's 2604. Dash 20 hammer drill. This is a brushless. So, right away, we have a handicapped in the DeWalt. It's not a brushed version. Or, it's not a brushless version. So, really, right there, we, we probably will see less runtime. But, this is a three speed, so it spanks the, uh, the fuel on the three speed. Now, during this test, we're, this is not scientific by any means. This does not mean anything. We're just going to take two fully charged batteries, run some stuff, and see what kind of runtime we get out of them. As far as specs go, they look pretty much the same, right, Eric? They pretty much do the same thing. Um, Half-inch chucks, metal chucks. Got the uh, both have the uh, ratcheting action, and you're able to both hammer drills. Yeah, both hammer drills. You can go from hammer drill to driver mode without changing your clutch setting, which is great on both of these drills. Now, if for some reason the Dewalt or the Milwaukee just totally spanks the DCD 985. We're going to bring in the old DCD 790, which is DeWalt's new brushless uh, tool. Now, this is not going to get any kind of runtime compared to this. We might put the 4 row on this and try to get that. This is obviously a compact drill, but uh, Milwaukee doesn't offer a compact fuel uh, ET bolt as of this uh, time of this video. So we've got fully charged batteries. What we're going to do now is we're going to just run this stuff through some uh, 4x4s. And uh, let's see what kind of runtime we get. What do you have to say? I don't know, they both, I think, feel pretty nice. I mean, I guess because I've been using Milwaukee a lot longer, that feels nicer to me. I guess I'm just used to it. This is, not that this doesn't have a nice grip, it's got a nice grip, but in terms of balance and all that, they, I think they both feel pretty good. Yeah, I mean, before brushless, I mean, even, this we, this could be proved we don't squeeze the trigger because we're testing them. Shut up. Just don't tell me to shut up. Do you want me to turn the camera off and do what I did do earlier, smack you around a little bit? And, and try to take my pants off? No, I don't <laughs> that. No, so, I mean, this tool fight, you know, this is a crazy tool fight. It's not, nothing scientific. This is for fun. This is what you right. guys have requested. We've seen a lot of people's this model number against this model number. That's why we're doing it. Personally, this is, to me, this is one of the best drills, if not the best heavy-duty consumer drill on the market. And when I say consumer, I mean, like, you know, there's, like, heavy industry drills that are, you know, like, $5,000 to the use for certain things. This doesn't use. I'm talking stuff you can find readily available in your local Home Depot store. Now, that being said, I went and looked up the DC-95, and they said it was discontinued on the Walt site, which I don't know if it was. This drill or the well, actual combo kit? Well, it was the kit. kit. It was the L2 kit. So yeah, but what about just this I didn't see alone? anything. But then I was looking for my phone, so I don't know. But I don't think they discontinued this drill. I mean, this is a workhorse right here. And that's Milwaukee's workhorse, right? Yeah. So that's basically cool. the tool fight, what it's all about. We're going to go Milwaukee's 18-volt workhorse against DeWalt's 18-volt workhorse, which is the 20-volt max. And we're going to use a six-and-a-half-inch auger bit. Um, the drill again, killer. They're both, we use these bits on one other, vi one other video. Right. They're not brand they're new. Not, they're not the same. They look about the same amount of use. One could be duller than the other. We don't know. <laughs> so they're like, well, why are you doing this then? No. It's just for fun. That's yeah. all it is. It's, it's not fun. saying this one wins. It's not saying that the wall's better. Or this one right. wins. It's not saying the wall's better. I mean, honestly, well, we all know that this one's better, anyways. But I don't know. I just I like this the fuel. Right? I, get, I like the fuel. I just I maybe mean, just because I've been using it a lot. Yeah, okay, but you, you don't know? use the fuel anymore because you use this now. That's where it's go-to drill, but it's compact. So we got our drill killer augers on. Let's get to work. Friday night tool fight.
right, there we go, you guys. Basically, uh, you saw that the brushless does give an advantage to the uh, Milwaukee. It did get a little extra runtime out of there. Same amount of power, just a little more runtime with the brushless. Eric's going to count up the holes. We got 46 with the DCD 985. 62 and a half. And 62 and a half. So, uh, roughly what percentage would that be, Eric? 20% more? I don't know. I've got the calculator. Do you, what's 62 minus 46? 16? Yeah, I guess. What's 16 divided by 46? Oh my gosh. Grab the calculator. Where, where, it's the your phone. Branch. Where's the calculator? The phone. Grab the phone. There. So, you guys. You know, like I said, it's not brushless to brushless or anything like that. You know, I mean, so we can't really... It's just having fun is all Yeah, right. we can't declare a winner on that one. What we're going to do next is uh, we're going to run the uh, <clears throat> compact through. 35%. With a, with a 4 battery. So but basically what we're saying right now is brushless gave us an extra 35%. Mm -hmm. All right, so basically what we're going to do now is we're going to take the compact. We're going to wait for that 4 battery to charge. Whip it on here, and that's going to give a Milwaukee the run for the money, I'm thinking. Oh, yeah. So, 46. What did you say, 62? 46, DCD 985. Uh, what'd you say? 60, what what'd you say? 62, Eric, on the 2604. 62 and a half, yeah. 62. 62 and a half. But I kind of think Eric cheated. He doesn't seem to think so. But if you look over here... Like it's the very top holes. part. If you look at it down there, see there's wood right there. It you doesn't matter, man. Look at mine. I did it's major holes. Thing. Like oh, you did a right couple, there. one or two. But I'm saying, see how there's wood still down? It rips off the top part of the wood right there. It looks like it's not. But okay, that's okay. Eric cheated, so he could get a couple more extras yeah, yeah. in there. Dude, you're an idiot. I'm an idiot. You're an idiot. You heard it first here on Tools and Action. <laughs> Dan's an idiot. Man, good thing we did record with that. That shut up. See, smart thinking, Eric, right? Yep, see, that was almost tools and action moment. We had another camera running, but it automatically just shut itself off. So, good thing we recorded it. Alright, we're gonna let this thing charge up and see what happens. <laughs> fight like I said nothing was precise basically we threw on the Milwaukee one inch drill killer bit and we threw them on these three drills and uh, we came up with some surprising results well not really We're just surprising. having fun is what it is it's well, not saying no it's dude that's really. not fun I'd rather be going to do something else than like drilling holes all day that's not fun like sleeping well Eric, getting a haircut Eric day is getting long I'm telling it you it is alright with the DCD 985 we got 46 oh. shut up we got wow, four. that smells like poo. What are you even doing with that thing? What? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Eric. Go ahead. Dude, you're really starting to get on my nerves. I don't know. DCD 985, 46 holes. DCD 970. <coughs> wow, ah, that thing is hot. I know. DCD 970, or, or I'm sorry, 790. We got 58 holes. So we got about uh, 12 holes more than this one. And the winner was the Milwaukee with uh, 63 and a half holes. But again, this one's brushed, this is brushless, and I noticed they're self-feeding auger bits. I noticed that you ended up pushing a lot pretty hard on your bits for some reason. No, I, well, it just looked like I did. I was, oh. I was just down there. Oh. Um, this has a 3.0 battery on it right now, but we did use 4.0 batteries all across the lineup. So, uh, yeah, Milwaukee took this for our longevity. Now, this wasn't a scientific test to really do a scientific test. We should have used, no, you said it was for fun. We should have oh. used a brand new bit each time, but we didn't. By the time it got to this drill, that bit was dull. So who knows? It's not dull with most of wood. It has, it's, I wouldn't say dull, but it has more use on it. 
more Dude, mile- the dull bit's not gonna drill. More <laughs> mileage. So, what do we what do we think here? This is a three speed. This has got advantage because it has a three speed. Uh, this is more compact. This has advantage over both of them as it's more compact and lightweight. As you can see, we got the weights right there. And I did notice that. Oh, that's pretty cool how you did that. It's like magic, wow. dude. I did notice the handle on this one gets really hot. Compared to these two, the handles were much Yeah, cooler. more of the keep it was up, up based top. up here. Um, but again, it's compact. Right. So, it's got, so it's still, got my favorite... I'm talking. It's got to have somewhere for the heat to go. So Go ahead. My favorite drill is still the DCD 790. Uh, you know, the Milwaukee, yeah, you get about what? how many more holes? Uh, roughly seven more holes with it. Was that? That'd be five and a half. 63 minus... 63 eight, and a half eight, minus 58. Eight more holes. What are you talking about, Eric? Eight more 63 holes. 63 minus 58 is what? I don't know. Five and a half, dude. It's not that hard. Take your shoes off. Or you know what? Your fingers. Well, right. smell like poo. <laughs> so we got five and a half more holes with the Milwaukee, but it's a lot more weight. You know, it's a lot more bulk. Uh, so, but it's up to you guys. You really can't go around with any of these brands or anything like that. We're not telling you to jump out and go buy this. Obviously, this is what Eric uses for daily use. Ow, that is hot. Damn it. Eric uses this for daily use, and I use this for daily use. This is my heavy-duty drill. Why are you twisting your head? You don't use this for daily use? Because if you don't use this for daily use, I'm packing it all up and taking it right now. No, I'm saying you don't use it for daily use. What do you mean? You said Eric uses it for daily use, and I use it for daily use. I don't Eric, think you use it for daily use. Yeah, I do. It's my very... I mean, you know what? We're giving something away. Say goodbye to your porter cable. All right, someone just won a porter cable drill. Who else can we give it away to? Who are you gonna give it to? Actually, I'll let you pick someone. I don't know anybody offhand. Are you serious? I'm serious. All right. Um, we'll do it in the next video. We'll give that away. No, I'm giving it away right now. All right. Are you serious? Start talking. Here, I got somebody right offhand. Who? We'll take someone from the form. All right. All right. So you're, you're good at that, aren't you? It, shut up, man. So someone on the forum is gonna win that porter cable. But uh, you guys, you know. Milwaukee, DeWalt, they all make good products, you know. Uh, we just tend to favor the DCD 790, even though this got a little bit more. Uh, you know, Milwaukee's definitely come a long way with their IntelliLink technology, basically the battery pack talking to the uh, motor, which is going to give you that. Uh, the Milwaukee's efficient. a great tool, I, and I use it a lot too. It's not like I just only use that one, I use them both. This is nice because it's got a hammer drill and all that doesn't. I'm doing concrete. Right, or this is like a hammer drill, drill too, that's a whole different you know, just. You know, it wasn't the greatest. Ah, damn! It wasn't the greatest tool. You're for like it. a rat in a box that doesn't learn about the buzzer. Shut <laughs> uh, up. So, um, you know, it's just this wasn't the greatest comparison. Did you wake up on the wrong side of the buzzer? You are. I noticed you're very testy today. Eric, I'm just not in the mood for you today. Are you ever? You know what I'm saying. I mean, I need one of these. You have extra propane. Not for you. Joe M from the. Uh, Powerful Joe M, you're getting a porter cable, no charger though, you're on your own. No, I'm no, kidding. Get a charger. Yeah, what'd you do with this? All right, Joe M, thank you for supporting us. You're getting yourself a nice porter cable, 20 volt drill. That's you. We just wanted to clear something up real fast. Uh, we did talk about the DCD 985L2 being discontinued. It actually is because now they have the M2, which includes. 4 batteries. Mm -hmm. so, so it's still the same drill, just different batteries, right? Right. So the whole test that we just did uh, was pretty much with the DCD 985M2. Yeah. So we had the 4 batteries. Yeah. So you can't no longer get you can't no, you can't longer. no longer you can no longer get the 3 0 kit. So which is great upgrade. I think oh, yeah. it's about the same price too. Cool. So that's it. Um, you know, hopefully you guys enjoyed the tool fight. This one was kind of hard. I mean, you know, there's Bosch, there's Makita, there's everything else out there. No, it's just those two because that's what we see from you guys a lot. You wanted to see the Dewalt versus the Milwaukee. It was us having fun. It's not scientific. Yeah. It's just two guys having some fun. Yeah. I mean, you want real tour reviews? Go to Tool Select. Yeah. You know. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, there's just a couple of our favorite drills. So the you know, who's the winner to declare? Well, it's hard to say. What? Put your arms down. Eric, shut up. I smell so much nicer than you. Probably. Alright, so let us know what you want to see next on the Tool Fight video um, on Friday Night Tool Fight. Uh, you know, you gotta give us some leeway. We're gonna try to do every Friday. Next, I'm gonna tell you what we're gonna do next Friday right now, but I guarantee it's not gonna happen because I'm jinxing myself. We're gonna do the 12 volts. Someone said right. a 12 volt. Uh, we're not gonna. Which 12 volt against what? The M12 fuel against. Uh, 
Uh, Dewalt 10 12. It's kind of not fair because Dewalt doesn't have a brushless 12. Well, what do you want to do? The impact or what? The drills control? and the impact and driver. The whatever driver, we can Drill get driver? Yeah, whatever we can get together. Alright. You know? And why did you say it wasn't fair? Well, because the Dewalt's not brushless. Oh, there's a yeah. Well, like Again, in this situation, the Dewalt wasn't brushless. We had to throw in the old compact. And the compact wasn't a hammer drill either, but I'm sure we would have got about the same results with the hammer drill compact. Yeah. You know? Uh, but still, this is my favorite drill right here, the DCT 985, man. This thing is a workhorse. If there's any drill in my arsenal that will not get something done, I know I can go to this drill and it's going to get it done. And if this drill doesn't get it done, nothing's going to get it done except maybe one of those big gas powered drills. Or go back to the Milwaukee. That'll get it. Yeah, not. No. Nothing is Milwaukee. Hey, I like Milwaukee. I love their stuff. I love their hand tools. I like their bandsaw. And I love this thing, their ratchet. Yeah, that ratchet's fine. That's one of my favorite tools right there with the 4 XC battery. Eric's jealous because I stole his 4 He had a bunch oh, of 4 Oh, that's right. So you got 4 so now I got 4 Go ahead, man. Go ahead. Just, you know you're going to pay me 80 bucks for it. Yeah, right. It's not free. Right. It doesn't go off trees. 4.0 amp hour batteries don't go off trees. All right, so hopefully you guys like the tool fight. You know, let the bitching begin. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>